Hello everyone and welcome back to Polynerdic Plays. Starting a little early. I posted just recently on the Polynerdic Twitter account and the Twitch account. The uh, the uh, schedule for today. It's uh we're gonna go from two until about eight o'clock. Gonna gonna um, take a little break for dinner and then be back around nine and do nine to ten thirty eleven something like that. I've broken down the schedule. If you look under the Twitch viewer here, underneath the screen, you got the schedule for today. We're going to do some Battlegrounds as a surprise early start. I'll do about 45 minutes of it. And then at 2 o'clock, we're going to switch over to State of Decay 2. I wanted to play some more of that. It's been a while. And then from there, we're going to switch over to Assassin's Creed Origins, the Hidden Ones DLC. And then before dinner, we're going to do episode three of Batman the Enemy Within and then after dinner who knows what the hell we're going to get into but those of you that have been watching me play Battle Royale before you know I do this under the branding Let's Battle Royale Badly um, not very good at these games I've got one victory and, and player knows Battlegrounds I've got one second place finish in Fortnite and one third place finish or two third place finishes and H1Z1 I forget uh, most of those have been done off stream since I've been streaming these games uh, I uh, haven't got nearly as high a finish so we're going to roll into this I'm going to suck, it's going to be entertaining and uh, we'll move on from here forgive me for drinking in your ear I'm thirsty it's cooler today than it has been that's another reason why I'm able to stream all day and talk, uh, because it's not pushing 100 degrees like it has been. Mm, don't have enough for a crate. Solo, third person. Got my awesome uh, Beat Takashi stylized jumpsuit looking thing from, I believe, Battle Royale. That's similar to what he was wearing in that movie. If you've never seen it, it's a fantastic movie. We're going to play this for about 45 minutes. I figure it's a match or two, maybe three, depending on how they go. Nice long load time to start it off with. Oh boy. I keep hoping that this PlayStation, or sorry, this Xbox version of Battlegrounds gets its shit together. Yeah, it's been out for about six months. It's still real rough. Case in point. It, it actually makes me really sad that H1Z1, which is a much newer port on the consoles, looks so much better than this over on the PlayStation. Frankly, in my opinion, it plays better too. But... All right. There they are. There's the houses I was looking for. I 
Cannot explain it, but I have a fascination with these two buildings. If you've watched me play before, you know I come here a lot. Two people are dead. I turn this damn game up. So quiet. Sound design is definitely a thing they need to work on. Shit, I'm actually outside the circle. the best place guns wise so we're gonna do this for about 45 minutes switch over to state of decay two It is. I don't go for those like I do in the, the crates and uh, the other games. Sell some shit for this. All right, got ourselves a decent gun with a silencer. I'm sorry, a suppressor. I don't feel like I pick up the uh, S12K nearly as often as I used to. I feel like early on that game was there. That gun was very common. Hear a firefight in the distance, just barely. This damn game is so fucking quiet. I 
Yeah, there's a house I was looking for. Thirty-four people are dead. I do have to admit, part of what I, I hate about streaming this game the most is Xbox's stupid little fucking screen thing at the bottom telling me how many people are watching or not watching and how long I've been streaming. I wish you would fade away. streaming so I'm not going to play overly cowardly today. Just stay on the move. See, now we're getting back towards where the plane flew through, so the odds of running into people are getting higher. Hands are a little numb from, I played a bunch of Lumines this morning, and the cost of vibration of the, the controller made my left hand kind of tingly. Let's go to this house that looks like it's out of Edith Finch. All ramshackle and built up. It's like three different houses stacked on top of each other. Somebody's here. Mm. All right. Somebody's got fucking red zoned. We're going to find a guy here. Door's 
doors open. Feels like a lot tighter than two times scope. I say it every time I stream this, but this game makes such an excellent horror game. You know, just this horrific concept of being all out in this shitty situation by yourself. That was over there somewhere. Speaking of horror games, I, I picked up uh, on sale this week, Outlast 2, finally. Really love the original Outlast, and it's a DLC whistleblower. So I'm looking forward to getting into Outlast 2. I know it's a completely different style of game as far as, like, it seems to be more trial and error from what I read. A little more supernatural. Someone just died over there. They altered this terrain. I don't remember it being this hilly through here. Am I wrong? Have I just never approached it from this angle? I don't remember it being like this. It has been a while though since I've played. You know, I rarely come to this part of the map. I 
I don't recall the last time I was actually here in, a, in the middle of a match. Drove past it a couple times, fleeing the uh, force field, but... have not really we've been at it for 22 minutes about 20 minutes in this actual match and haven't seen a soul Well, did it? He's got a car. That's not something I want to fuck with.
Somebody went down. Got me, damn it. Son of a bitch. All right, one more to one more go. That took twenty seven minutes, just about. One more attempt, and then we'll switch over to State of Decay 2. Gonna give myself plenty of content to have to sift through and upload to YouTube. Still gotta do my Yakuza 6 final couple episodes. So I'm like four or five of them. I gave myself away on that last one, ran right up on him. All right, here we go. Where are we coming in from? 100 people this time, not 97. That makes a huge difference. Let's just go ahead and jump in. We don't see this side of the, of the map too much. So I always have a tendency to go for those two houses we started at last time. Here's hoping for a better, better overall run. I mean, 27th is a pretty damn good finish for a game I haven't played in two weeks. Looks like we picked a shitty drop location. Healing items, at least. Found a lot of good that's gonna do us in a firefight. Bunch of 
fucking revolvers and handguns and shit. No real guns. Oh, fuck's sake, guys. Fuck's sake. Should have stuck with my usual houses. My usual houses never. Well, I can't say never. They have done me wrong plenty of times. That's a fucking handgun. It's 1911. I mean, that's a, something to sneeze at, at least in the real world. Don't know how it translates here. Don't know how spicy the uh, fucking temple is either. Ruins. Oh, there we go. And then I'm dead. Well, shit. <laughs> At least we got a kill, huh? Of course, the firefight got someone else's attention. But at least it's not all me running around avoiding people. Got a handgun kill. They really need to dull out the uh, BP a little, a little quicker. It needs to be doled out for like survival, length of time in the match, stuff like that. Can we get the other map, please? It's funny, every time I live stream this game, I, I see the map maybe once for each live stream. But the other day I played this just on a whim, about two weeks ago. Oh, same fucking map. South. Same for these two houses right here, see how this goes. I do have to admit there's one thing I think H1Z1 does a decent job with is the random 
drops. It's a an element that this game doesn't have. As far as like you don't know. Ooh, there we go. Now nah, that's a good gun. Gonna get to do shit with it, but it's a good gun nonetheless. Whoever kills me will enjoy it. That's the way we need to head. She's getting real nearby. Get a decent gun up here. Last time I got into the top 10, it was right in this area. if anybody's home.
There we go. Alright, so we gotta kind of go that way. It's gonna be a little late starting the, uh, Day of Decay stream, but at least it's on the same console, so I can just jump over to it immediately. Bummed out that we did three matches and they were all this map. I have such limited experience on the new map. It's kind of a drag that it's not more heavily rotated in. My experience on it hasn't been entirely pleasant. But that's also largely because I never get to fucking play it. Oh shit. Sucks to be you, dude. That has to suck. This kit and shit. There it is. Get a little two backpack. That sucked for that guy. Keep doing that when I want to do this. All right, so getting hit by a car is no longer as immediately deadly as it used to be. I thought I was fucked there.
I was just fucking hip firing into the car. That is awesome. Bullshit, but awesome. Yeah, I might want to turn this way. That's going to get cut for a highlight. My shit. Is it damaged? No, it isn't. Apparently getting hit by a buggy doesn't damage your bulletproof vest. Remember that. Like the AKM, it's a good gun. I've had good success with that gun. That's pretty close. That sounds like it's coming from over here. tell what direction the fucking shooting's coming from anymore. Fuck you, I'll take that ammo. I almost said armor. play hyper aggressive. Hear gunfire, run towards it.
right. On the move. I can't get over that kill still. That was something else. I put that right up there with the, uh, when I did the Polynard play test of this. <coughs> oh shit. Fuck. Got sniped. Stopped to reminisce and got killed. Alright, that's gonna do it for, uh, Let's Battle Royale Badly. I'm gonna hop off real quick. Break out that that clip uh, for the sake of hilarity. Upload it to YouTube and then be back with Stand to K2 for two hours. Enjoy my stuff, dude. Whoever you are that killed me. Thank you for watching. Be back shortly.